guys, welcome back for, uh, to another video. Today we're gonna go to the car wash because I'm gonna change the color of my wheels. Yes, I'm gonna change the color of the wheels. White looks badass and all. Uh, it's time for another color. And you just gonna have to wait to see what color I'm gonna do. But first, I'm gonna go to the car wash, wash the wheels, take off the try to take off much dust and dirt as I can and then get home and finish uh, cleaning them off and prep them get them ready for paint so let's get going So I got one wheel off, I'm gonna get ready to prep. Almost took off all the dirt, just need a little bit. And mask everything off, get ready to paint. dry with the sun so it can dry faster <clears throat> y'all are guessing what uh wondering what color i'm gonna paint i'm gonna go with the nardo gray things gonna look sick with the red maybe if it doesn't i just go black on the wheels i also got this brand the same brand i, uh, I painted my black trim with but let's see how it goes this one also has a a glossy look in the sun let's see how they turned out then it's gonna look pretty sick so before you get painting you want to grab some rubbing alcohol and a clean rag mine's not clean but oh well we're gonna go with the clean uh, with the alcohol rub it around the wheel just so you can get uh, free of any grease because if you if the wheel or the paint whatever you're gonna paint is greasy the paint's not gonna stick well and it's, it's gonna bubble and then it's, it's gonna be like wrinkly but let's get to it. Okay, let's get the first coat going. guys so I end up doing five coats it looks really glossy and shiny really like the outcome it looks like I got them professionally done you see how they gloss if you take your time and not rush it you're gonna get a, a good um, results you just take your time don't rush it but what's most importantly is prep 
that's the most important part of all this. You want to prep this the right way. Take your time, clean it very well, get all the grease, dust, all you can, as much as you can, and just go and paint afterwards. Just waiting for it to dry so I can move on with the next wheels. So I went off and painted the, the center caps black with the same paint that I, I still have with, uh, from doing my trim. A little chrome, so I had to paint them black. I'm gonna do red so they can match my lug nuts over there, but I don't have red paint. Oh well. So this is the fourth coat, one more coat, and I'm done with this wheel. I didn't want to show it on the video because I showed it on the first one. And I think most of y'all know the, the process. If y'all painted your wheels before, well, that's how it looks. With the lug nuts on, I taped the center. I'm gonna take it off. The car's aired up right now, so it looks whack. This is how it looks, turned out. Liking it so far. Let me know what y'all think, guys. Still got two more wheels to go. I gotta finish by two because I work at four. Anyways, let's keep going with the video. So, here you have it, guys. Looking pretty sweet, in my opinion. The dark colors flow together. I want to get rid of that white sticker. <clears throat> Put a dark one. I like how it looks. It's pretty sweet. Pretty fresh. I was gonna do black at first, but I was like, let's go with the, a gray first, and then we'll if we don't like it, we'll see how it looks with black later on. It turned out to be fabulous. So this is, for, uh, anyways, guys. This is it for this video. If you liked it, subscribe. Sorry, share, subscribe, like, comment, all the good stuff. Um, stay tuned for more videos. Next up, I'm a, either I'm gonna paint my calipers red or tint my front and rear headlights. I still I'm still need to put those fender flares. I bought. I'm slacking. I haven't had enough time, and this is my daily, so and I only have one day off out of the week. So I have to take my time and find a good time to do it because I don't want to rush it and make it all sloppy. But for now, I like how it looks.